Now, for organic search engine optimization, we're going to cover meta tag authoring. For meta tag authoring, you're going to have three major sections. Your title, your keyword, and your description. Now you're going to want to spend time writing each. You're going to want them to keep them very concise, very focused on the theme of the actual page itself. Now when we're looking at the title, I'm going to go back to the search engine optimization example. So for title, I'm going to use the keyword search engine optimization. Now everybody has their own style of SEO, but I prefer to use three to five keywords per page assignment. So when I'm going to assign words to have to do a search engine optimization, I'm going to use the keyword SEO, all lowercase, I'm going to put a comma, I'm going to actually use SEO with spaces in between it in case somebody types in with periods or spaces. And then I'm going to assign the keyword search engine optimization. Now when I'm writing my keywords, I'm keeping everything lowercase because a lot of people most commonly type in words on the search engine in lowercase. And the search engines actually reflect how somebody is searching to the words it's actually going to match up with in a keyword base. So you'll want to make sure you keep your characters in all lowercase. Now, you want there to be a logical pattern between your title, your keywords, and your description. So you're going to actually assign a description, which is going to be the description the search engine is going to list below your website, most likely, unless it actually pulls content from your page, right below the listing of your website itself. So you'll want to write something that has keywords in it and say search engine optimization, commonly known as SEO, allows you, commonly known as SEO, allows you to list on the search engines. Now what we did here with the description is we hit upon a few specific keywords so that we're not placing too many keywords in the meta tags, but you can see the actual logical pattern going from your title into your keywords and then from your keywords into your description. As you can see, the word SEO up here in your keyword assignment reflects down to SEO in your description. Then you have the keyword search engine optimization here in your description, linking to the keyword within your meta tag. And you can see there's an actual logical pattern going from your title, your keywords, and then into your description. If you want to actually assign numbers to it or letters to help you organize it, you can say one is SEO, one is SEO, two search engine optimization, two search engine optimization. Play with it however you like. Like I said, everybody has their own SEO search engine.